it's a powerful story. It's an anti-war story. It's a story with people that are affected. It's not anonymous. It's uh, and a different. It has a range of characters and emotions from betrayal to all sorts of. You come at night, you stay with a farmer, you do your job, assassin or bomber. What happens to your host? It's not your concern. He's sure to be shot for his good turn. What good will all this courage do when thousands killed before through? You come at night, you stay with a farmer, you do your job, assassin or bomber. What happens to your host is not your concern. He'll be shot for his good turn. What good will all this courage do with thousands killed before? I do Hollywood film projects, I say goosebumps and tears are not optional. But that, that all stems from this genre of opera, that goosebumps and tears should not be optional. I, I will confess, I actually had goosebumps tonight in some of the places, in the reading, and I said, aha, we did it, we found it, we found the right tempo, it was moving. I heard that the fascists shot your mother and your father, and your sister and her husband, and Joaquin, I'm, I'm so, so sorry. These are people who are living at the edge, who are, some of them are going to die, they're going to kill people, and these are the emotions that drive them. And I, I want to see that dramatized in a, with music. I've determined that I need to be authentic to me. And it needs to speak from my heart. Because if it doesn't speak from my heart, it's not going to communicate. What passes with that Inglis? Is he building a bridge or blowing one? Calm yourself, woman! He's finishing his work! What in the name of the Great War does he take so much time about it? That's all that's left for me to do. Jordan aims his machine gun. He presses the trigger. The gun fires in a deafening roar. But I cannot kiss! I do not know how! Where do the noses go? <laughs>